I had prepped us here, so we cut one of the snakes shedding it, her skin and as you can see she's got a little bit of stuff on her head but I'm gonna help her with that later on and now let's see how the, the shedding is coming off she pushed all the papers and all that stuff to the side here so now let's wait a little and let's see how she's getting out of her old skin I can probably hear her hissing yeah. That's probably some, some stuck shed in her nose and stuff like this, so yeah. I'll try to help her later on after she's done shedding. And sometimes they, they just get a little bit stuck on their head. Most of the times they usually get it off by the end they, they by the time they finish shedding but we'll see how she does. Well anyway as you can see she's, she's kind of crawling out of her skin and the old skin is kind of uh, flipping to the let's say left side or left something like that. I don't know how to say it but she's kind of uh, rolling out of it. So you can see how it's getting off yeah she had it stuck on her nose right there so basically her whole head is in, still in shed so I'll help her later on but now let's focus here. You can see how she's moving her muscles to get rid of the old skin. And you can actually see the difference in colors. How much brighter she is over here than she is over here. Actually she's really light so um, I was breeding her with a uh, few males so I hope that uh, she's just starting to glow. because. Yeah, she's really, really light. Same on the head here. So, yeah. Let's hope she's glowing. So, that, that would be a great sign. open it a little bit more she's kind of crawling out of it let's say and it's coming off pretty nicely in pretty much one piece because sometimes they just shred the whole skin part around the whole top so this one is getting off pretty nicely. Yeah, there we go. Figured out it's open, so let's hope she stays in the tub. You can see she's still trying to get rid of the piece that she's having on her head by rubbing it on the sides of the of the tub unfortunately it's not uh, it's not rough it's rather uh, soft in touch uh, no, well maybe not soft but it's uh, uh, 
it's pretty flat. It doesn't have any rough spots, so it's harder for her to to get get rid of it. There we go. Now she's gonna cover it, which is probably gonna help her also a little bit. So she's kind of like she's helping herself, basically. Mm, there you can see how much is coming off. Really nice. And of course, after she's done shedding, it's uh it's good to check uh, basically uh, if the eye caps came off because that's the most important stuff that she won't have any eye caps left because uh, if you leave them on after some time she might just get uh, get uh, too many of them and she won't be able to get them off by shedding another time so this might actually hurt her eyes in the long term so it's good to, to check if those are off and uh, you can check on the by the tail and the ventral scales if there is anything left over there and of course on the tip of her tail so there is not no not not anything left over there and on the other all the other let's say places are pretty safe because if she even have a little bit left on her back and it won't hurt her it will probably kick, come off uh, later on but she just looks nicer without it, so I usually take it off anyway, if, if there is anything left. But as you can see here, she's doing pretty well, really nice normal female. Yeah, so she's about to finish, getting close to her ventral scales and the tail, you can see, there's her whole it's still uh, soft and moist uh, after after a while after she's done it will get it, it will dry out and you can see it's basically transparent so many people think that uh, because when I tell them that they ask me what I do with the sheds and I tell them I throw them away and they are asking me why I do not make like a belt or, or a bag or something like that out of it but uh, they think it's just a fake skin that she's leaving behind, but this is just basically like a transparent, very soft, uh, almost like a foil, so it's not good for making anything. <laughs> but just people who have no clue about snakes in general, or uh, how the shedding looks, they just don't know that, so as you can see. You would be able to make a belt out of it. Yeah, there we go, We're getting closer to her butt, let's say. <laughs> and uh, sometimes they just rip rip the shedding in this place so it's like I said it's good to check after she's done almost there
Just checking what's left. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. She's also trying to rub by herself or onto herself to get rid of the stuff that she's got on her head. Just came off from the from the side here and basically from the bottom and the whole top part is still in in the shed. So I'm just gonna help her later on. Now let's watch her finish off and uh, we'll end the video there. And it's already a 10 minute video so I don't want to make it any longer but this process takes a while and as you probably saw I uh, I started recording basically in the middle of the shed so And of course, basically, right after you're done shedding, you'll probably see some uh, uh, crap <laughs> after they defecate and they go to the bathroom, basically. So many times, right, with the shedding, there is some dirty stuff in here. So for now, it's pretty clean, but 100% later on, there will be some... Uh, nasty stuff in here and she, she's still trying to get it off her head and just one more little push out of here and it will be done It's taken forever. <laughs> so this is just a small little piece left. Maybe, maybe now. Nah. See? See, she's got a little bit more off of her head. So basically, like I said, she's gonna get rid of it by herself, probably. So for now, I'm just gonna make sure that she's not gonna go outside the tub. And of course, she covered her tail. Then she's probably out of the shed completely by now, which we again did not see because she covered it. So. Alright, so that's it, um, hope you enjoyed the video, it's a pretty long one, but uh, for all of you guys who do not know how, sna how snakes shed their skin, here is a cool video. So stay tuned, subscribe of course to the channel and see you soon. Shortly after I finished filming, she got uh, it herself off of her head and it's looking pretty nicely. So you can also see the eye caps over here and over here. And uh, that's good that she got them off. So there she is. Alright guys, stay tuned.